In this video, we'll show you how to customize data screens on a Vivo Active 5 smartwatch. To customize data screens on the watch, begin by pressing the Start button in the upper right corner. Then, select an activity profile. For this video, we will select the Run profile. Then, swipe up from the bottom of the screen. Scroll down and select Settings. Select Data Screens. Tap the screen you'd like to customize. Select Layout to change the number of data fields on the screen. Layouts can have between one and four data fields per page. Tap the screen to make your layout selection. Then select Edit Data Fields. Select the data field you want to change, followed by a data field category. Then select an available data field option. Press the Start button to confirm your selection. Press the Back button to get back to the activity profile. You can follow these instructions to customize other data screens, or you can start the timer to begin recording an activity. Now we will show you how to customize the data screens in the Garmin Connect app. For this process, we will be using an Apple iPhone, but the instructions are similar on Android smartphones. Start by opening the Garmin Connect app. Then access the menu by selecting More in the bottom right. Then scroll down and select Garmin Devices. Now select your Vivo Active 5, followed by Activities. Then select an activity profile you want to customize. For this video, we will select Run. Then select Data Screens. Select a screen to customize. To change the layout, select Layout. Select one of the available layout options. Then select a data field you want to customize. Select a data field category, followed by the data field that you want to display. You can do this for any other data screens you want to customize. When done customizing the data screens, press the back arrow until you get back to the main menu. Then select My Day to return to your Garmin Connect dashboard. And that's it. You can now customize the data screens on your Vivo Active 5. For more help, please visit support.garmin.com. Thanks for watching.